Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Today I have something really cool here. This is LG's new 2017 InstaView refrigerator. And you're probably saying, what is InstaView? This is InstaView. What? Okay, yes, that is the InstaView feature. This thing here, which this is a piece of tempered glass that's on the front of the refrigerator. And what you go ahead and do is you knock twice and it will illuminate this compartment so you can see what's inside. And there, you know, we have all the essentials. Reese's peanut butter cups, some milk, more milk and some juice. And uh, this is their door and door refrigerator. So you go ahead and hit this little button here and it will only open up this compartment, not the whole refrigerator. Their point is that way you can quickly access quick two items and you don't let out all the cold and the whole purpose of this is so you could see what you need or what you may or may not have without having to open up the refrigerator those quick items again so if you always put your milk there or your juice there or what have you then you'll always know like oh okay we need this we need that without having to open up the refri refrigerator so this is their new 2017 InstaView refrigerator this retails for about four thousand dollars yeah it's 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 no joke peeps uh this is their four door french door refrigerator so you know you have your one two and then three four and uh yeah i'll go ahead and get in here so you guys can see okay let's go ahead and open it up so you guys can see and uh i will be the first one to tell you this thing is a absolute monster it's 29.7 cubic feet uh, we had a counter depth refrigerator before that was about 24.5 or something like that. And, uh, you know, we needed the extra space. Uh, we started to notice before that once we had leftovers or barbecues or something like that, we were running out of space. So this time around, we said, let's get a monster of a refrigerator. And uh, we just won't have that problem anymore. That worry will be long gone. So, uh, yeah, what do we have in here? I'm going to go ahead and switch perspectives so I can move around uh, so you can see everything inside. Normally, I would set this up in a stationary position, but this thing is just too big, and I'll be too far away for you guys to uh, accurately see. Okay, so like I said, it's 29.7 cubic feet. One thing that I like about their design here is they don't have the ice maker right here taking up a huge portion or a huge chunk of the fridge nor is it bulky on the door and it still has useful compartments uh, let me go ahead and open this so you can see and there's the compact ice maker for those of you having super large parties or you're worried about ice this compartment not being big enough not holding enough ice for your large party i mean me myself i will probably just go ahead and run to the liquor store or something and buy some ice so it's got some easy to reach tempered glass drawers right and then here some slide and access now these drawers are fairly fairly large you guys let me tell you it may hard to um it may be hard to tell just how big they are on the camera but you know trust me i mean this this thing is huge i mean look at my arm look all the way back and yeah it's nuts there's a two liter on half of the shelf uh, push this back so you could, you know, fit a two liter or something upright. So you just push that back and then you have that room. Uh, the shelves are adjustable. This has their new fresh filter multi airflow, which I don't know what that is, nor do I care, but I know it's a good fridge. Uh, yeah, it has LED lights inside. It's very, very bright. Uh, something that we absolutely love here that we wanted my wife and I instead of the traditional three door we wanted the four door because we like this custom chill drawer so you open this up and there's a bottle of my wife's favorite wine but uh yeah anyways the custom chill drawer you can select what temperature you want this so it isn't just for refrigeration it isn't just for freezing but if you want to go ahead and put other items in here let's say we need more freezer space uh, then we can go ahead and switch the temperature to that if we want to put wine in here if we want to put cheese milk whatever we want we can select that temperature here and then use the drawer for that that's why they call it a custom chill drawer because you dictate the temperature 
All right, and this is the stainless steel. Oh, you can also get into this compartment from the back. You push, sorry, I only have one hand. Push, and then this opens up and you can get to it from the back. Okay, and this is supposed to be their smudge proof uh, stuff. So far, so good. It just got delivered not that long ago. We still have the plastic on here. I haven't even taken it all the way off, as you can see. Oh, this is so simple, but it, it, it's such, it's so ingenious. Usually, you have your water and ice on the same dispenser, and then you hit a button on the side, and then it changes the ice. You hit a button on the side, changes the water. How many times have you gone going to get water, and then it was on ice? Or you went to get ice, and then it was on water, right? Well, no more. They separated it. Water is always water, and then under here, ice is always ice. Uh, yeah, let me get a cup really quick so you guys can see how big the ice cubes are. Okay, so, get some ice going. Just so you can see. Eh, about average size, right? But I love that there's no more, oh, let me get some water and put in my water bottle really quick, and then now I'm dumping ice all over the ground. Uh, I get a lot of compliments on these. You want to ask, they sell them in different color. These are uh, refrigerator door handle covers. So for those of you that have kids or you might be cooking and your fingers be messy and then you touch here and then you got to wipe it and clean it, you don't have to worry about that. When these get all nasty and disgusting, you throw them in the wash and then that's it. Uh, we don't have kids, so we don't have to worry about that, but we like things to have that new look. And then we'll get into the freezer. Now, I'm not sure how much each compartment holds. I'm just showing you. Uh, I do know this little tray here doesn't look like much, right? But it's big enough to where you could put frozen pizzas or a Klondike bar. Little frame of reference so you know just how thick it is. Not one, but two stacked on top of each other. So this is actually a very deep tray. Don't let the smooth taste fool you. Looks can be deceiving, but it's actually very deep. And then you have this compartment here which, you know, have some frozen pizzas in there. As you can see, not much. We just got the fridge and haven't done much shopping yet. And then this is very deep, and I love how far this comes out. Yeah, this is the stainless steel model. It comes in two colors. It comes in stainless steel and a black stainless, which is a new trendy color that everyone's getting now. But believe it or not, the stainless, we, we uh, love the look of it. And uh, it matches the rest of our uh, appliances. I'll show you here. We have an oven there. And then a oven and microwave combo. So, like I said, it matches the rest. Oh, yeah, and the dishwasher and stuff. But, yeah, it matches pretty much everything else. So, we love the look at it. Look of it. Yeah, this was brand new. I had been reading about this, and I saw it on stage when uh, LG unveiled it at the CES show. And I... We needed a new fridge, and uh, I thought, why not this one? This one's just cool. The wife loved it. She co-signed on it, gave me the thumbs up, so we went ahead and got it. And uh, yeah, is it is it costly? Sure, $4,000 for a fridge. Uh, yeah, it's, you know, it's a little much. It's a little much. But uh, this will be the be-all, end-all for a very, very long time. And uh, let me, I'll put the stats like the dimensions and everything in the fridge on the screen so you can see right now. Before we had a counter depth, which was great about counter depth was, uh, you know, it only came about this far past the counter. As you can see, this thing is a monster. Uh, we do have the floor space for it, so not that worried. But uh, it does protrude out a little further past your counter than uh, maybe one may like. But it was either style and look versus um, functionality. And we're going to need storage this time around. So uh, something that I learned too as well is make sure the uh, you have enough space, not just for the fridge height and width, but also leading up to it. You know, when, when the guys come in, they're gonna need a clear path. That's something that uh, they were telling me about, but anyways, I didn't have that issue, but you may. So don't just measure the space where it's going, but you may also wanna measure the space on how it's getting there. But yeah, this is it. LG's new 2017 InstaView refrigerator. And uh, hopefully if you go to buy this, you'll love it too, as we do. And hopefully it's on sale. It's a little 
It'll cost you a couple of nickels. All right, guys. Insta view. Light us.